On a normal day, this is me. But today is far from a normal day. But to catch up to speed, we have to go back to a few days ago. I was just chilling on the beach, minding my business, when all of a sudden... Hey, are you Jabril? You like writing software and all that jazz, right? Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> Who are you? Oh, I'm the boogeyman, man. You know, tis the season and all. Halloween around the corner. Hello. All right. Look, I'm in need of some AI software. I'll pay you a hundred thousand. How's that sound? Whoa. You'd really pay me a hundred thousand for a project. Yeah, sure. I'm the boogeyman, man. I can get you anything you want. I just need you to shake on it first. What do you say, buddy guy? <laughs> okay, deal. Now, what type of AI software do you need? Oh, well. I am looking for AI that knows everything, and I mean everything one would need to know, so that I can use it to spook all of my friends out. Catch my drift? Whoa, wait, what? Yep, that's what I want, and you've already shook on it. So see you in about a week with it completed, or else I'll steal your soul for an eternity. Okay, sounds good. See you then, buddy guy. But that's impossible. And that's what happened. Now, if you don't understand how complex the AI that the boogeyman was asking for, then let me explain this for you. Oh, and by the way, AI stands for artificial intelligence in case this is new to you. So like building software and robots that can think on their own, pretty much. But this is a no questions asked impossible task. Even if I were to find a magic lamp and tell the genie that for one of my wishes, I wanted an AI that knows everything, the genie will literally snatch the lamp away from me and say, yo, I'm a genie guy, not some damn super genius miracle worker. Good luck, pal. So this is a huge problem. How can I write an impossible AI that knows everything? <sighs> Feeling incredibly pessimistic, I signal up Super F of X for some help. AI that knows everything, huh? Well, let's think about this. You could use machine learning algorithms and try that route, but let's face it, man. Between the two of us, we don't have enough data, let alone experience to even consider that. So. We need to think of something else. F, I really would just like to keep my soul, man. Just please help me. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Oh, I think I got just the idea. Here's what we can do. F and I wrapped up our little sit down and I instantly got to work on the idea. Guys, I think I might actually get to keep my soul after all. A couple of restless nights go by and at last it was completed. Sam says sweet sounds.com aka my AI bot that knows everything. But Jabril, you said that that type of AI is impossible. Yes, listen, I know, I know. But with a little imagination, guys, anything is possible. So here's how it works. Sam, my AI bot, knows everything. Well, at least everything that Sam needs to know. And this is done by using what's called a live dynamic database. Sam makes his own decisions based on who's using the software and the questions asked. But it's very important to implore with Sam. You see, Sam is kind of needy and likes for you to implore to access his database. But after you appropriately implore with Sam and ask a question, Sam might answer your question using data from its LDD. And that's pretty much all that's to it. Now, let's get to the exciting part and have Sam answer my friend's questions. Okay, let's see, who am I with? Brendan. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Wait, do that again. Okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I gotta videotape this. So what company does my my friend work for? Ebster. <laughs> I don't like this. Uh, what do I call him? Beyonce. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. How does it know that? Can you type what is Alps manager's name? Or can you type what is my friend's name? Okay. I fought or something. Woo! Oh my god. Okay, I don't like this. I gotta leave. Can you ask if they will show us mercy when they take over? Okay. To be honest, they have no reason to. We don't plan to take over. Yet. <laughs> Come on. Ask her, if, ask her if, if she's ever gonna be used against us. <laughs> Maybe don't ask that question. No, ask her. We need to know. No, not for now. <laughs> Not for now. <laughs> what do you mean, not for now? Ifa. Whoa! <laughs> wait, wait, wait. 
Wait, wait, wait. Why? Can you ask it? Why? How do you spell it? It's easily the most impressive shit I've ever seen. Me, right? No? Kyle and L. <laughs> what the f? <laughs> what the f? <laughs> what the f? <laughs> How is that even possible? Dude! Dude, it was! Okay. This can't be a human answering this question back. There's no possible way to answer this question back this fast. Put your phones in airplane mode. Let's see if we can get it. Not even though it could tap into the Wi Fi because it knows the password. I thought I was not gonna live to see this day. They're gonna know every, anything and everything about you. I'm pretty sure if you ask her. What? Yeah, ask her what word I'm, I'm writing. Okay. Wow. Are you serious? Are you serious? Let me see. No. What? How? Bro. Ah. How did she know that? How did she see that? How? Ah. As a human, there's no way I could have. Uh, these guys are knowing too much. I didn't see it. What's over there to the right of me? Ah. Oh, f. As a human, there's no way I could have. Ah. Oh, these guys are knowing too much. How did they see that? What's over to the right of me? How. If they can make robots that can have tap into this data base. That fast? <laughs> We're done. Yes, I am so glad that this solution worked. And all we had to use was just a little imagination. Now all that's left is to confront the boogeyman and collect my 100,000. Hey, 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 big boogie. How's it going, my man? Oh, buddy guy, what's up? You got my goods? You betcha. All you have to do is go to samsetsweetsounds.com and here are the instructions on how to use it. All right, one sec. <laughs> Buddy guy, I knew you were right for the job. And now to keep up my end of the deal, here's your payment of a hundred thousand. Any second now, it should be here. Oh, here it is. 100,000 dead rats just like we agreed upon. Dead rats? I, I thought it was $100,000. Oh, no, no, no. We never agreed on the currency. Besides, 100,000 dead rats is a lot more festive, don't you agree? Thanks again for the spooky software and oh, have a happy Halloween. Oh! <laughs> Well, I hope that you at least enjoyed today's episode. And if you happen to see the boogeyman, please tell him that I am looking for him. Anyways, samsetsweetsounds.com is up and running and the database used for that website literally does know everything. So if you want the instructions on how to use it, just come follow me on Twitter and send me a private message. I'll let you in on all the secrets and you can use it to spook all your friends out this Halloween. Trust me, you'll have a great time. <laughs> I want to give a huge thanks to my friends Treezy504 and Finite Atticus for featuring in this episode. Please go check out their latest work, links are in the description. Also, if you enjoyed this project and you want to help me continue to make more like this, then please make sure you subscribe to this channel and share this video with your friends because it helps out a lot more than you know. And I'll appreciate you greatly. Alright guys, that is the end of my spiel. I hope that you guys have some fun with Sam this Halloween. Please spook all your friends out and if you happen to do it, record it and send it to me, I would love to watch that. That would be awesome. But whatever the case may be, remember to always feed your curiosity. Cool. All right, and action.